learning to stand up for theirself. This women's only self-defence class was set up after the murder of Sarah Everard. My name is Nele and I'm going to self-defence classes for one because it's a lot of fun and I'm also doing like other martial arts in, in the MMA club and going with my friends is a lot of fun. But I'm, I'm also doing it to you know, get more confidence and feel safer because I've had a couple of bad experiences in the past. For example, when I was pretty young, I was I think around yeah, it was just 14, I was in a water park in Spain for a summer camp and um, I was pulled aside and pretty badly assaulted by a group of five adult men and it was traumatizing enough that I don't remember much of the entire day. <laughs> This wasn't the only time something like that happened to me and um, I've done a lot of work on myself to you know, feel safe so I don't think that I need those classes to feel safe but it definitely gives me a lot more confidence. Like going here after a session like this I feel like if anything bad ever happens to me again I just have a better way of reacting and I'm not immediately in the kind of victim role that I used to be in and that just make, gives me a lot of confidence. Yeah, thank you so much for telling your story and I'm just so sorry that happened to you. What advice would you give other women to make themselves feel safer and help them if this does happen to them? Um, first of all, just it's never your fault. I know that I blamed myself and all that kind of stuff. It's not your fault. And um, just be prepared. The world is not always a nice place. So go to these kinds of classes. Um, as bad as it sounds, like watch your back, be careful at certain times, just like, you know, check the risk, but don't let it stop you from living. Just, you know, have a friend with you. I'm here, you're gonna lick your hands together, and now I'm in a frame, and I'm just gonna push away. Okay, and as I just relax, as I do that, I'm just gonna, boom, I'm gonna do this. This class helps young girls feel safer and know what to do if they are attacked. Also, it has been described is being a very fun thing to do. Now what's important is that if you don't put your leg out in a way that they fall onto it, i.e. this way. If you put your leg out and they fall here, you're going to have a bad day. Okay? So we don't want that. Okay? And I've seen that. So I really don't want that. Yeah? So we're here. So I'm just going to tap this ankle. Okay? And I'm just going to pull. And I'm going to pull here on the elbow. And I'm going to tap this ankle. And my leg is going to be like that. Okay, so when your leg is like this and they fall onto it, nothing's going to happen. 